Hello everybody and welcome. My name is Daniel and for this how-to video I'm going to show you how to produce a podcast. First, let's go over what a podcast is. A podcast is a radio style program that is delivered via the internet using a RSS feed which publishes updated works such as a podcast or blog and it consists of multiple episodes. Now let's start going through steps of how to produce a podcast. The first thing that you're going to need to figure out is your theme or mission for the podcast. What is the purpose for producing the podcast? Now throughout this how-to video I'm going to share with you an example. The example is the podcast that I produce called Special Chronicles. You go to specialchronicles.tk to check out the podcast. Oh, Dan, Smugoski.com. You need to plan your show notes. You need to decide what topics you are going to talk about. This can be as simple as creating a list of topics, just a simple list. Or you can have a, a Google Docs document where you have either a detailed script or maybe you just have an, an outline. Then it's time to, 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 uh, to get your setup of your studio. Now, this can be as basic as a computer and the internal mic. But I'm going to share with you what I currently use. The, so the first thing that you're going to want is headphones like these. Then you're going to want to have a microphone, some type of microphone like this microphone right here. It, it comes with a little desk uh, top stand. And you're going to want to have, of course, have your computer, either Mac or, or Windows. And then you're going to want to have a little mixer like this. Or big mix, so if you are more professional or advanced. And this little setup that plugs through this little control box through via USB to my Mac. Setup costs about one house. So that that gives you an idea. It's something so simple, but yet the quality can still come out really good. Uh, or you of course you can use an audio recorder that goes in that goes in, 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 into the mixer and record like that. So once you have your setup, it's time to actually record. So some podcasters I know record straight through from beginning to end like a radio program. Check out The Break with Father Roderick. The Break is an award-winning weekly show about movies, technology, games, health, food, and faith. From the Simpsons to the Sacraments, from technology to theology, The Break features the cool and the classical, the past and the future, the trends, and the tradition. Download the show for free on iTunes or listen at sqpn.com. I those may, may recall, like, my, what, I, what I currently do right now is stop and go. Stop and put a uh, talk and then blah, 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 and, and then stop and put in your, your jingles or bumpers. Now I'm going to show you just, just a few of the applications that I've come to know. The first is GarageBand, which is the easiest for the Mac. And GarageBand is part of the iLife suite and it comes free on every, uh, on every Mac so if you just open up GarageBand click on create new podcast episode in other words Adobe Edition now Adobe Edition is, more, is for the more advanced podcaster and this is uh, mainly a Windows application but uh, in doing some research found out that Adobe Edition is coming soon to the Mac and then there's Ubercast. In the Ubercast, you can play and record audio clips live. And this is for the Mac. Uh, and then there's Audacity. Now, Audacity is, a, is, a, is a, another simple application. And, and it's either for the Mac or Windows, and it's a free download. Once you decide which application you want to use, then it's time to edit. So you want to listen back, and you might need to cut out anything that might not see. And then, uh, once you edit and you know this is the final, uh, edition. once you're pleased with the sound of your recording, it's time to publish it to the internet. So, uh, in order to publish it to the internet, you're first going to need, well, to, to export it as an MP3 file. And once you have it as an MP3 file, you're going to want to have a hosting service. Now, there's a few hosting services I'm, I'm, I'm going to share with you. The first is a, is a service that many podcasters use, and that's called Lipsyn. And the cost starts at $5. So if you go to Lipson.com, you can find out more information about this service. And then others, like myself, use MobileMe and the iWeb application on the Mac. 
So this is pretty simple if you already have a mobile me subscription. Others may use a free hosting service. It's called mypodcast.com. So that's about the hosting service. Then you're going to want to make sure that you that you have some what's called ID3 tags. Finally, you're going to want to make sure that you have a website or blog. Now most services come with a pre-made blog. And this is the central place where, where your listeners will come to find out about your podcast. And that's where you, again, where you can post your show notes with links to stuff that, topics that you discuss. And so that's how to contact you. Hopefully this uh, how-to video has uh, has helped you in how to, how to produce a podcast. Thank you for watching uh, this how to produce a podcast video. And uh, you can visit me at dansmikowski.com.